Some students think they know everything, especially those green environmental wackos. Hey, it's a free lecture. And there was one of them sitting right in front of me. Fellow students, I'm Greer Green. I'm here to talk about wind energy. Now, how many think we should have more wind farms in Iowa? That's right. Well, there are lots of uh, points to be considered before we decide where we're Now, you know very well the advantages of wind energy. The fuel is free. You don't have to haul in coal trains. It's locally made, not imported from foreign countries. It's a renewable resource. It creates rural jobs and economic development. And now there are some disadvantages to wind energy you really need to know about. The wind is an undependable fuel supply. You never really know when it's going to blow. You can't schedule it. Wind turbines are like 10 to 20 percent efficient. That means 80 percent of the time they're not doing anything. There are very few transmission lines out where the wind turbines would be built. So they're high maintenance machines. And there's a few large industrial loads nearby to use the power wherever a wind farm is located. The good news is Iowa is number one in wind turbines. They have the most wind farms of any state in the nation. They're located all over here like this. So, there's so many wind farms. Are the good spots taken? Are there any good places left? The choice is up to you. Thank you very much for your time. Sure, sure. If we put just a few wind tur turbines in Sioux City, yeah, you think it'd generate, generate enough energy to make it be worth it? Well, we got good transmission lines around here. Yeah. We got good industry around here that could use the wind yeah, power. Definitely. Know any uh, farmers with uh, good windy hillside locations? Oh, yeah, I'm sure I know a few. Well, then maybe we'll look at developing the next wind farm in Sioux City. That's a good idea. Well, I guess this old geezer can learn a few things.